What's up, YouTube? Baby Jack up here, Rob Ricks. I am back again with another episode of Story Time. You know, I'm tearing through these fucking stories pretty, pretty quickly. And, uh, you know, I, uh, tearing through these pretty fast. I don't know if, uh, I'm curious how long this shit's gonna last. But anyway, um, I have a medical condition called sleep apnea. It affects millions and millions of people everywhere. Uh, I used to just think that I had really bad snoring. And um, I'm going to share a couple of stories about that. And this was before I was diagnosed with sleep apnea. So my snoring is legendary. And, and I'm going to stop you because everybody's going to say, oh man, you know, yeah, my homeboy is legend. He's fucking loud. No. Trust me when I tell you my snoring is epic. And I will, I will illustrate a few examples. So I had my, my brother-in-law living with us for a while and I was teaching him Photoshop and it was when Angel was first born. And, um, not only did I have sleep apnea, but I was sleep deprived because we had a brand new baby. So I was fucking beat tired. I was just beat the shit tired. Off. <laughs> I'm so tired. I can't, can't keep my eyes up. <laughs> and, you know, whatever. I remember one time Junior was watching Angel as a baby. And I laid down on the couch because I was fucking tired. And I fell asleep. And I woke up and this motherfucker was just staring at me like this. And I'm all, dude, what's up? He's all, dude, you're snoring? I could feel it in my chest. It has bass. Like, I could feel it in my chest. And I'm like laughing. I'm like, whatever, dude. You're fucking stupid. Fast forward a little bit. I uh, had to take a sales trip with my friend Ron. And I warned him. I said, dude, we should get two rooms. Because I need my own room. He's like, nah, we'll save some money. <laughs> Excuse me. We'll save some money and we'll just get the one room. I'm like, dude, that's not going to fly. I snore really, really bad. He goes, oh, we get, dude, my dad snores, my brother. Don't worry about it. So that night we go to bed, right? Sales trip, whatever. Go to bed. I wake up. Where the fuck is Ron? Where's Ron? I go, I look for him. He's in the bathroom. The motherfucker had crammed towels underneath the door. Slept in the bathtub. Woke up mad as shit. He saw, fuck you, dude. I fucking hate you. I'm like, dude, I told your ass. I told you. I told you, Ron. Get separate rooms. He's like, whatever, whatever. We were doing Street Warrior stuff. Me and my former partner, uh, Mike Pearson. We were traveling, and we were in L.A. Yeah, L.A. And uh, we stayed at a friend Anna's house. And I told him, I said, dude, I snore really, really bad. He's like, nah, you're fine. I fell asleep. I wake up. I can't find Mike anywhere. He went to the furthest room in the house, closed the door, and just did his best to oh my god um he was in the furthest room just to try to get away from me and it was horrible so anyway uh it came to a point where I was just falling asleep and I fell asleep in a really important meeting with a bunch of executives around me and they, it was a real important meeting and I just and I opened my eyes and everybody was staring at me and I told my wife something's wrong here so I went and got checked out and um, sleep apnea is pretty easy to tell you go to sleep you wake up you still feel dog tired um, and also your loved ones people around you will tell you 
you have this pattern of snoring like mm, 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 right with sleep apnea it's a, mm, mm. silence 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 <sighs> snore 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 so there's a stop the part where you stop breathing you suddenly gasp right so anyway, I went in for the sleep study, and the guy, they put these sensors on you to, you know, microphones and all the stuff to measure the volume of your snoring. This dude, after I was done with the first part, said he had to turn the volume down off the sensors because I was peeking them out. And then he also said he had to close my door to try to mitigate the noise that was coming through because I was waking up other people during the sleep study. Which was fucking hilarious. And then he told me I woke up 107 times an hour uh, from the sleep apnea. And uh, he's like, dude, how the fuck do you even exist? You're not getting any sleep, you know? And um, fortunately for me, God wired me with hyperactivity. And that hyperactivity allows me to fucking get burst energy and go blah, 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 because I run that speed all the time. And I actually have to ratchet it down to a normal level so that people around me don't get fucking irritated when I'm talking. But normally I have thoughts that go blah, 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 and I just fucking go, 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 go. And I'm just fucking like this all the time. So that got, you know, reduced because of the sleep apnea. So I was functioning, but I was still not fucking getting any real sleep. So they got me a CPAP. CPAP is a machine that blows air and it sits on my fucking face and straps on and I Look like a complete fucking ass hard, but it blows air constantly. So the minute that I stop breathing and the air pushes it, it forces my, my body to automatically keep breathing. And uh, the first day that I used the CPAP, I felt like a fucking million bucks. Superman ain't got shit on me, you know? Uh, so, you know... If you've got sleep apnea, just deal with it. Use the machine. It'll save your fucking life. I know it saved mine. Um, I look stupid when I'm wearing it. I wear it all the fucking time. I use it every fucking day. And uh, I can honestly say that I feel so much better. I feel so much better using it. And I've tried days where I just take a little nap on a couch or something. And I am wrecked. It it just doesn't work. You gotta have it. So anyway, that's Rob Ricks, and uh, you know that's one of the fun things about being me. So I have sleep apnea, and I use a CPAP. Yes, I'm Rob Ricks. I have sleep apnea, and I use a CPAP. Yeah. So anyway, uh, if you like it, like it. Please subscribe to all your fucking friends. Until next time, be good to each other.